Hello everybody, what's going on today? I hope you're all simply having a wonderful Christmas time and welcome to day 8 of the 12 days of Christmas Cars Diecasts and today we're going to take a look at Dynaco Cruiser Mirrors. So, so after winning the Florida 500 and triumphing over Jackson Storm, Ru Rusty's owner, Sterling, offered Cruz to race for him and, and replace Lightning McQueen, but Cruz rejected it. Then Tex, the owner of Dynaco, offered her the Dynaco team and replace Cal Weathers. And and Tex also bought Rusty's from Sterling. And 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 she accepts it with Lightning McQueen as her mentor. So, so let's get right into the review. You know, so on the front we have. So on the front we have her. friendly, smiling, happy facial expression, we, which is the white teeth smile, and her friendly eye expression, in, and on the top we have her, her eyelashes in black, like most female cars in the Cars franchise. We got a modern Dynaco logo on the top of her hood. And working headlights. And on the side we have we've got another Dynaco logo and a blue number 51 and a blue dinosaur and blue rim black modern black wall light year racing tires and a gray cast cap on this on the left side and another Dynaco logo on the left side of her spoiler and several piston cup logos we've got hold on let me see for a moment the piston Cup, Combustor, Synergy, and Carbon Cyber, and we also have the the exhausts pipes on the sides, and on the top we got a number 51, no name signature, and on the back side we've got the red red back headlights and a Dynaco logo and a blue number 51 and yellow rookie stripes and more exhaust pipes on the bottom and and on the top of her spoiler we've got another Dynaco logo and on the right side the exact same thing and let's compare them to the other, other her other variants. We've got normal cruiser mirrors. Normal, I mean normal cruise. Oh, I, I forgot to mention that here. And here's slight differences between those two, because you can see you got this normal normal cruise has no spoiler and. In windshield, in side view mirrors, 
and normal stock rims, while well, the Dynaco Cruise doesn't have side view mirrors and 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 light your tires and a spoiler. And on the on the back side we've got normal cruise has this a CRS logo and license plates saying C O one dash zero six A while the Dynaco Cruise doesn't. And then we've got Cruiser Mirrors as Francis Belt Line. Which is the exact same model, I mean, about the same model as Normal Cruise. And, and finally, and lastly, we've got Rusty's Cruiser Mirrors, which is from the Piston Cup Races 11 pack that I reviewed months ago. So, so while Rusty's Cruise has no sponsor logo on the hood, the Dynaco Cruise has, and, 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 and on the sides, and so we've got the the Rusty's cruise has old school red rim light year tires, while Dynaco Cruise has blue rim modern light year tires, and and with Rusty's ninety five on both sides, right? no continued GC sponsors, while Dynaco Cruise has. Dynaco 51 on both sides, and on the top, Rusty's Cruise has no number, while Dynaco Cruise has a has a number. Both of them, no name signature, and on the back side, Rusty's Cruise has the CRS logo and with a racing number on the back no rookie stripes or sponsor logo while Dynaco Cruise has a sponsor logo on the back another racing and has a racing number but does have rookie stripes and on the back of an honor spoiler no sponsor logo, while Dynaco Cruise has a sponsor on the logo. And let's com and let's compare her to the other Dynaco racer. And let's compare her to the other Dynaco racers. The, an evolution. We've got S Strip the King Weathers, who. Yes. So, as you can see, there's a slight differences. The the Dynaco logo is classic, while this Dynaco logo on Dynaco Cruise is modern. Because, yeah. but there's slightly different color changes. We got Dynaco blue and Dynaco yellow. And we also have Dynaco Lightning McQueen. We also have Dynaco Chick Hicks.
finally, Cal Weathers, which she Cruz had replaced in 2017, the following year, after Cal Weathers had retired before the final race of the 2016 Piston Cup season. And compare her to, and compare her to other cars that have that have differences that have the same way the same deck the same things as her like with like her number fifty one let's and let's compare her to other cars with the number fifty one like Fabulous Doc Hudson Hornet. And finally, Ruby Easy Oaks. Although, although they were going to have for before during the production of Cars 3, they were originally planning to have an easy idle stock car named Carl Clutchen have have Carl Clutchen easy idle stock car in Cars 3 to be 51, but since they want Cruiser Maris to be 51, they decided to change Easy Idle's number from 51 to to number 15. And now, for her, for other female race cars, besides Cruz, we've got Misty Motorcrass, Carla Veloso, and finally, APB. And, and compare her to, to the other Piston Cup racers with her rookie stripes. We've got Jackson Storm, because on the on the back side, right, the rookie stripes are the same way, the same way with other next gen racers, and and lastly, we've got regular Cars One Lightning McQueen, because you can see the rookie on the Plain Cars 1 Lightning, the rookie stripes ha have a slogan, while the Danico Cruz doesn't. So, Lightning McQueen have had these rookie bumper sticker back in 2005, right? so he doesn't need it. So he doesn't need it anymore. He's a racing veteran now. So, Oh, and uh, I forgot to mention that cr I believe I forgot to mention that Cruz is a 2017 CRS coupe. Although, ho however, I believe that Cruz is a 2005 Aston Martin. So. 2005 Aston Martin. But, but what do you guys think? Which version of Cruiser Miras is your favorite? Which Dynaco racer is your favorite? Which racer, which number 51 racer is your favorite? And which female race car is your favorite? And which race car with rookie stripes is your favorite? Leave your Please leave your thoughts as well as any suggestions in the comments down below. And if you like this video, please thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll see you tomorrow for day 9. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that this version of Cruz Ramirez is my most, most favorite version from all the rest. 
So, I hope to see you all guys tomorrow for day nine. So until then, Merry Christmas. Goodbye now.